Hello everyone, welcome to another video. If you know me, you'll know that I don't like paying for too many subscriptions. Just think about it. ChatGPT costs about $20 a month. Claude AI costs about $20 a month. Gemini Advanced costs $20 a month. If you want to use models like Mixtral or Meta, you need to pay per your token usage. If you want to use an image generator, you'll also need to pay for something like Midjourney. This means if you're an AI fanatic like me, who wants to use all these models and generate images, you'll need to pay around or above $100 a month, which is quite a cost. But what if all this could be more than 50% cheaper, have all the latest models in one place, and allow you to use whatever you want for one price? You can even make a complete application using this AI. This video is very useful for those who work with multiple AI tools and pay for all these huge subscriptions. This 8-minute video will save you money, so watch carefully. Click on the link in my description and you'll land here. So, this all-in-one AI website is called AIMagicX.com. If I click on the Solutions option, you can see how many features they offer. The first one is AI Logo Designing. If I sign in with Google and click on AI Logo Designing in the main dashboard section, you can see that I just need to write a logo description, choose the logo design, and then select colors and sizes. Now click Generate, and you'll see our new business logo ready with more features. As you can see on my screen, the next solution is AI Magix Coder, which is especially for coders. I click on AI Magix Coder and land on this page where you'll see many new things for this feature. I click on Try Magix for free to explore this feature, and then I land on the main dashboard. Here, you'll see many features, which is why I say this is an all-in-one AI tool. I click Magix Coder to build an application. After clicking, I land here, and you'll see on the top right side options like GPT 4.0, Claude AI 3.5, and Gemini AI Pro. I like the Claude 3.5 model because it's currently the best at coding. So, let's select the Claude 3.5 Sonnet model. At the bottom, you can send the prompt. Let's ask it to create a to-do list app. Once you send the prompt, you can see the code being generated. It's super fast. Now that the code is generated, you can look at it here, and it looks pretty good. You have three options with the generated code. The first option is copy the code, if you want to paste it into your own code base and use it. The second option is analyze the code. This option is really cool. It allows you to generate detailed documentation for the code and improve the generated code. Let's click it and check. As you can see, it goes through four steps. Scanning your code, doing a code review, improving functionality and code structure, and generating documentation. We'll need to wait a bit. Now it's done and you can see a really long documentation about each aspect of the code. And the code is also much better with styling and everything. You can also copy it or download it in markdown format, which is really cool. The last option is preview the code. As soon as I click it, the preview is ready. You can see that the to-do app it generated looks really cool. The system prompt is doing a good job here. Let's check the to-do app now. It's working correctly now. Let's try to change something in this and see if it works. Let's ask it to add an edit option in each task. As you can see, it's making the changes. If we wait a bit, the changes are done. And here's the code again. We have the same options with the code. So let's preview it now. It loads correctly. Let's add a task here and edit it. It's working fine. You can ask it for changes, and it can do that. It's pretty cool because you can't have everything perfect in the first generation. Once everything looks good, you can click on the download button and the code file will be downloaded, or you can use the copy button to copy the code. Now, let's also try to generate something more interesting, like a snake game. Let's create a new thread and send the prompt. The code is being generated. Let's wait a bit. Here's the code. Let's preview it. This is pretty cool and works fine as well. I really like how this looks. It can generate almost anything and works really fast. Plus, you also get the option to generate the code using multiple models, which means you are not just limited to one model and can use multiple models as much as you want. The platform also has multiple other features like a logo generator, image generator, story creator, and more which is quite cool. Also, guys, if you're involved in online business, AI Magics can help you boost sales and traffic. Have you seen the AI library? As you can see on my screen, if I click on it, 
you'll find multiple features on the left side. For example, if I click on Articles and Blogs, you'll see that this AI tool can generate blog titles and paragraphs. This means if you're into blogging, this AI tool can help you create blog articles. I think it generates content even better than a normal ChatGPT blog article because it uses ChatGPT 4.0 and Gemini Pro, which means the blog data is updated. If I click Blog Paragraph Generator, you'll see a box labeled Topic or Keywords. If I paste something like iPhone 16 versus Google Pixel 9 dash dash since Apple launched the iPhone 16 and I want to make a blog on this, you'll see the AI tool asks for word length. I selected 500 words and set the number of results to 1. For tone of voice, I selected professional. You can also generate your blog in multiple languages. After selecting everything correctly, I click generate paragraph and you'll see the result. All right. You'll see the final result on the right side. You can see the title and the main blog article that you can paste into your WordPress. It's amazing how this all-in-one AI creates the article, complete with headings and bullet points. They even describe Apple Intelligence versus Gemini, which is amazing. But that's not all. You can save and create a new document. You can also explore many things like ads and marketing and general writing. If you do e-commerce business, you need to explore these features. I love this all-in-one AI tool. You can also see many things like the image generator. If I click on AI images, you'll see I created an image. If I click on it, you can see the prompt, the style, cinematic, the size, and the interface with many features. And honestly, I have to say that if you run an online business, you will definitely want to use this tool because it has all the features in one place. You can visit the homepage and see features like AI chatbots, and Meta is included in this AI tool, which helps with your online web applications. You can also see the gallery of AI image generators by AI Magic X, which is an alternative to Midjourney. This means you don't have to pay separately for Midjourney and ChatGPT 4.0. With a single sign-in, you can create logos, as I mentioned in the introduction, and I'll show you how to do it. Although they have a free tier, I'd recommend getting a subscription for smooth operations. If I go to the pricing plan, you can see that there are three options, monthly, yearly, and lifetime. Although I recommend going with the lifetime pricing because this is 100% worthwhile instead of paying per month. You can see how many features are included in the lifetime plan. The lifetime plan starts from $59 and goes up to $139, and the most popular plan is the Mist plan, which is pretty cheap considering you get a bunch of tools, including an image generator, article generator, and access to all the major models. 